wrong for telling my fiance that I want my ex-husband to walk me down the aisle on our wedding? Why? But why? Why would you want that? Why is your ex-husband at your wedding in the first place? Tell me that much. I know this sounds messy, but hear me out. My ex-husband and I were together for 7 years. We got together at 18, got married at 20, and divorced at 25. Our divorce didn't end in bad faith, we just weren't compatible as a couple anymore, and we wanted to explore new things since we were glued together since 18. We remained good friends after the divorce. I met my current fiancé at 26, and we got engaged 6 months ago. I am now 28, and my fiancé is 20. At first, I didn't know how to bring it up to him about how I'm still close with my ex-husband. I had introduced them to each other, but I never disclosed any details of my and my ex's relationship because I was afraid my fiancé would not be okay with it and would make me choose. And if you don't choose him, that means you still have feelings for your ex. I 100% agree with him making you choose. That is... I'm one of those people where I don't believe you can be friends, super friends like that with an ex. I think you can be cordial, but that's about it. There is no need for my ex to be at my wedding or part of my life. Like, you gotta let that go, leave it in the past. My opinion. My ex and I decided to never let him know. But a couple of months ago during a family barbecue, an aunt of mine slipped up and revealed how I used to be married to my ex. Wait. You introduced him as an ex, but you didn't say you were married? Oh my god, you are setting your marriage up for failure. My fiancé wasn't happy about this and almost broke up... Am I wrong for making my wife think that our son was missing? My wife has a horrible habit that I discovered two months ago. We were ordering lunch on the subway app and I told her to pick the location that has a drive through that way we don't have to go inside and take the baby out of the car just to clip him back in a few minutes later. She told me it's not a big deal to leave the baby in the car to run in and pick it up really fast. I had no idea she ever did this. I told her I was not comfortable with her leaving him in the car alone even for a minute and she told me that she's been doing it since he was born and it's always been fine. Oh my god, that is not okay. She told me she does it to pick up food, run into the post office or pharmacy, etc. I was floored. We don't live in a horrible area, but it's also not super safe either. I told her to not ever do this again. She told me that she never stopped to think about the potential danger and that she would stop doing it. Well, yesterday as I was driving home from my brother's house, I spotted her car at the gas station near our place. It was parked in a spot up front, not at a pump. So I figured she stopped in to grab some snacks, which we like to do. I decided to stop and go in and say hi and get some food, and I pulled in and parked next to her. However, when I got there, I was furious to find her son in his car seat. The car wasn't even locked. Ooh, she's asking for a CNN story. I don't know what came over me.